persons having anything to do before the Honorable Robert B. Collings, Magistrate Judge of the United States District Court for the District of Massachusetts, now holding in Malden, in and for the District of Massachusetts, may draw near, give their attendance, and they shall be heard. God save the United States of America and this Honorable Court. Court is now open. Please remain standing for our national anthem, performed by Gentilis Jettis. Oh, say can you see by the dawn's early light what so proudly we hailed at the twilight's last gleaming. Now, I know what a special day this is for you because I am an immigrant also. My parents came from Poland. I can still remember the day when they became citizens. I was eight and a half years old, and they took me with them to Boston for the swearing-in ceremony. And they were so excited and happy and proud to be Americans. And then a few months later, we went back to City Hall in Boston, and I got my citizenship papers. And I still have that piece of paper with my picture on it. I'm nine years old. Today, no matter what country you are from, whether you are a man or a woman, whether you are old or young, rich or poor, no matter your religion, no matter the color of your skin, you are an American. Thank you for coming here. It is not easy to leave your countries, to leave your home, to come to a new place, to start a new life. You are very brave. And you and your children make this country strong and special. Thank you for coming to the United States, all of you. And today begins, or perhaps marks for you, uh, a, a moment in your journey and toward the wonderful gift that you're giving to your future generations, and that is this great opportunity um, to thrive uh, in the United States of America. And I think it's already been mentioned, but I'll say it again, because I really believe this is the case. We live in a multicultural country. It, it is what makes us great. This is constitutional, after all, and Article One of the Constitution says that Congress would uh, establish a uniform law of naturalization because they were all immigrants. They understood it's so important to make it possible for those that want to and those that are willing to take that risk to have them come and inhabit this country and bring their energy and enthusiasm um, and, and, and devotion uh, to, to these United States. And you are the living embodiment of, the, of what our, our founding fathers foresaw when they made this possible. on thee and by thy good we brought the good from sin to shine in sea from sin to shine in sea Raise your right hand and repeat after me saying your name after the word I. I hereby declare on oath that I will support and defend the Constitution and laws of the United States of America. That I take this obligation freely. Congratulations to you all. 
um, it's very fitting that you uh, take your oath of allegiance in a community like Malden. It also has a tremendous history uh, of accepting uh, immigration, uh, people from new parts of the world, uh, from new areas of our own country, but especially from new parts of the world uh, to become uh, this great community. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, liberty and justice for all. Congratulations. Thank you. The United States District Court for the District of Massachusetts is now closed. I'd ask you to please remain standing while the judge exits. Thank you, and again, congratulations. Congratulations to all the new citizens. Yeah. 